Even if you don't Even if you don't save me through the fire I know you're able to save through the pain and the sorrow. I know you're able to get me out of this situation. Even if you don't, I will not run away from you. Even if you don't save me, I will not deny you. Even if you don't give me what I want right now, I will not run away from you because nothing shall separate me from the love of God. Nothing shall separate me from the love of God is it money will it be finances your family let nothing separate you from the love of God child of God I love the account of these three Hebrew boys Shadrach Meshach and Abednego they said oh ye king we don't care what you're telling us we don't care you telling us to bow down to this golden image we know we will not bow to this image and even if you throw us into the fairy furnace, we know that our God is going to deliver us. The God that we serve, the God of Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. Yeah, me, I'm saying that because they were Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. You may be saying that in your life. There might be something that has been risen upon your life today, a giant in your life today, a situation at work that you're being told to bow down to that situation. You're being told to change things here and there to fit the circumstances and situations situation but you say that i will not bow down to this golden image i will not bow the three hebrew boys said that we will not bow that we know that our god will save us uh, i love the next statement that even if he does not save us even if he does not deliver us we know we know he will deliver us but even if he chooses not to deliver us because he's god he can choose what to do uh we will still not bow we will not bow and you know what these young boys put god on a pedestal and i'm sure where god was seated on his throne in heaven he was like who are those three men who are those invoking who are those saying such a who are those saying who are this i gotta do something for them i gotta change their situation i gotta do something for these three hebrew boys i gotta change their situation today i gotta show them that they is a god in heaven i will show this king nebuchadnezzar that there is a god who liveth i will show him that there is a king of kings and god in his majesty he sent his son jesus christ to you know and he entered the people who were throwing Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego into the fairy furnace, these people themselves were consumed because this fire was added seven times and seven times is a number of perfection the devil might have added a number of issues into your lives knowing that he has destroyed you completely knowing that you will not see tomorrow has gone to the witches and witchcraft done enchantments against your life done enchantments against your marriage done enchantments against your education number seven seven times knowing that this one is done but i'm telling you child of god never bow to whatsoever the enemy is showing you mm. don't bow to what the devil has put in your place don't bow to what the devil is telling you don't bow to the circumstances surrounding you do not bow to the voices in your head do not bow to vituqua ground do not bow to the noises around you shadrach meshach and abednego never looked at the circumstances that were prevailing around them they said that my god the god that we serve the god that we believe in speak to that situation tonight speak to that disease tonight speak to that situation tonight that my god that i believe in is gonna rescue me the god that i serve is gonna heal me i don't care what the doctors have said i don't care that i've gotten a death penalty today i don't care what they're saying what i care about is that i have a god in heaven who is able to do exceeding he 
is able to do exceedingly raba is able to do exceedingly abundantly is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all man it is not a exceedingly abundantly above a few things it is not exceedingly abundantly above some things he's able to do exceedingly abundantly above all and this god that i serve is gonna save me he's gonna come into my situation because i know that i'm not alone the bible says that you are not alone you are not alone because you know and you know that you know that you are not alone he's on your side and the moment these three hebrew boys were thrown into the fairy furnace because the king was so mad he was so angry who is that that will not bow down he actually gave them a second chance he said you guys you know bowing i give you a second chance to bow down and they were like yo <laughs> you've not tried us these hebrew boys were thrown into the fairy furnace they were thrown into the fairy furnace that was added seven times to destroy them completely to kill them completely but when you are in a situation you everything is done it's a done deal that is when the lord comes in that is where jesus comes in what do you know what happened when they were inside the fairy furnace they did not burn and even when they were brought out of the fairy furnace they did not smoke they did not smell like smoke they did not smell like smoke people will wonder that you don't smell like your disease you don't smell like your situation you don't smell like you the poverty that is disturbing you you don't smell like somebody who has been rejected because god is turning that around jesus was in the midst of them jesus was in their midst child of god when jesus is at the center when Jesus is at the center, everything is all right. When Jesus is the source, everything is all right. And the king looked into the place where the three boys had been thrown into. He saw four men and these people were dancing. They were dancing around. They were celebrating around. And he saw a fourth person. He was like, this person, I, we, th we threw three we threw, threw three men but we can see four of them and indeed the fourth one looks like the child of god looks like the son of god they will see jesus through you they will see jesus through you they will know jesus through you that which was made to destroy you that situation that has been made to pull you down that situation that has been made to kill you it'll bring people to god it'll be turned around why because you are not alone you are not alone child of god you are not alone jesus is with you in that sickness is with you in that challenge he is with you he's walking with you every single day day he's holding your hand he's going with you do not be disappointed do not be challenged do not be disappointed have hope keep hope because jesus is on your side even if he does not we will not bow don't bow to fornication don't bow to corruption don't bow to anything that is against the word of god know that you are with jesus and he is with you in that situation he is the ever-present help in times of trouble he is always there with you just believe and trust in him and because of the obedience to the holy spirit to the obedience of this these three hebrew boys this king declared that no other god shall be worshipped in our place he said that we from today we shall not worship any other god apart from the god of shadrach meshach and abednego that which was meant to kill you that which was meant to destroy you will put you on a pedestal it will catapult you put you on a level where people will see god and give god all the glory because he is in the business of exalting himself through you don't worry about what you're going through trust in the lord and in the power of his might because he is good and his mercies endure forever 
Amen. Father, we thank you for ministering to us tonight. Thank you for coming through in our situations. Lord, we say we are not going to bow into our situation's demands. We will only depend on you, believe in you, and walk with you. That as you order our steps, Lord, we shall purely and a hundred percent depend on you because you know the end from the beginning order our steps today lead us in the paths of righteousness for your namesake that you though you though we walk through the valley of the shadow of death we will fear no evil because you are with us pearl radio the home of fresh and classic hits 